How have you been? How's 2020 been treating you? And what is going on? Howdy, Dennis. Thanks for having me on. Um, you know, it's been pretty wild being in the States during COVID, seeing as they got the highest number of deaths. Um, been on lockdown for a while. Been off work for six months. Just getting some training in. It's been it's been good for training. I haven't haven't had much to do work wise. So um, it's been a wild ride so far. So when you say you've been on lockdown, are the lockdowns really that harsh? And I only ask this because, as I just mentioned, the Lakers have taken the championship this year, right? And the first thing I saw is, even though it was like, obviously, the the, the game itself was in a bubble, um, I saw that the celebrations outside of Staples Centre were absolutely insane. And once again, there were a few people wearing masks, but I'm like, there weren't that many people wearing masks. And, and, and then, like, I think at the moment, you know, a few months back, New York was the hot spot for, um, for cases, but... I think the latest statistics say that California are actually the the, the hot spot at the moment. Um, so yeah, what what is the vibe like over there? Like, is it real real lockdowns, or or is it just like kind of suggested that you you keep to yourself? So the first the first month we were mandatory lockdowns, like don't go outside unless like you could go out for exercise and to get food and stuff like that. But other than that, go home. No businesses were open, gyms weren't open, nothing was open except for essential essential needs, food, stuff like that. Um, it got a bit better. The Everyone, everyone in SF started wearing masks um, inside. Well, it's mandatory to be in, inside with a mask, so it's been pretty chill here. Uh, I know I went down to LA in July and... Orange County, not one person was wearing a mask. <laughs> it was pretty wild. I'm, I'm walking around with a mask on. Everyone's looking at you going, why are you wearing a mask? I'm like, uh, there's been a few people dying so far. So, um, New York's calmed down, but I heard it's, I heard it's back on the rise again in certain communities. Well, yeah, my, my, my partner's uh, from New York and, and at the moment, like she's in Brooklyn and, um, yeah, she's saying that they are starting to close like suburbs of Brooklyn, they're, they're, they're starting to close them up again. Um, I mean, the scary thing thing for me, I guess, is, you know, we over here, we've done all right, so you should have stayed in Australia. But um, we, 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 we've done all right here and we've just been through winter. I think that's probably the concerning thing is that you guys have had these numbers in summer, but you, you're now heading into winter, which is flu season and everything like that. And that's, I guess, where we a lot of things will come out now like whether yeah definitely on the east coast uh their winters are much more extreme than over here in california so it's pretty mild here in the bay area um doesn't rain a lot doesn't get too cold la's a bit better san diego is a bit better so i think i think it shouldn't be too bad but um i'd, I'd watch those east coast states 